Hey peeps, welcome to the Crafty Witch UK. My name is Arietta and today is one of those lovely videos where I get to open a witch casket. So um, for those of you that don't know, witch casket is a monthly subscription box. Um, it is based in the UK. It is a mother-daughter small business um, and everything is just so beautifully put together. Um, I have a whole playlist of these unboxings. Um, so if you enjoy this one, why not go back and look at the others? One of the nice things is once you become a subscriber to this box, you will get access to their online store, which sells any overstock items they have from previous boxes. So if you send me unbox something previously, um, you may be able to go and purchase it from their Emporium store, but that is only available to people that subscribe to the boxes. So without further ado, let's get inside. Okay, so the April box. Each box has a theme. The theme for this one is high power. So it'll be really interesting to see what they've put in here. Um, so this is our little leaflet, our booklet that tells us about everything that's gonna be inside. I'm gonna put this to one side and we'll come back and check through it later. As always, we get a beautiful art card every month. Uh, this one is beautiful really lovely these images for me i always find that you can look at them and constantly find your eye drawn to different parts of the image um, and this one does that particularly well we've got the candle we've got moths we've got clouds hands crystals really really lovely and on the back of the art cards they now include a manifestation prompt so you can fill this in if you want or you can just use it to help to guide you in speaking out loud it's entirely up to you how you use these um, i like to keep one where i can see it when i'm meditating so it gives me something to concentrate on rather than having to think of nothing um, but you might like to just keep one on your altar and change it monthly you might like to pick one that seems to be relevant for any spell work that you're doing and use it as a focus there. You might just want to display them as beautiful pieces of art because that is indeed what they are. So again, a monthly regular is the spell kit. And this one, we have got empowerment spell powder kit containing everything you need to make a magical spell powder for empowerment. Oh, did not do a very clean job of opening that. In here, oh, it smells lovely. We have got, okay, so we've got one, two, three um, envelopes. These are yarrow, bay and mint. And then we've got our information here on how to use our powder and again just beautiful artwork that carries through that theme so really really lovely and um tells you different ways that you can use this of course oh sticking with a herby theme power up herb blend a magical blend of century blue cohosh and red carnation a magical herb blend to add power to any spell or ritual. Use to dress or circle candles, add to charm bags and spell jars or use in rituals. And we've got a pouch there of a pre-mixed herb mixture in there. And as you will be noticing, everything is packaged in biodegradable packaging. It's all very reusable really nice indeed each month we get a pin badge this one is very lovely so we've got a pentacle there you can see it's got crystals and sparkles and things behind it which are all drawing from that same 
similar imagery that we've seen in the background of the art cards pulled through into here. There's a single pin back on here. Very nice indeed, it's like a pewter kind of tone. Really, really lovely that one. Very nice indeed. Okay, I'll go with the crystal because I can see it already. So we've got a piece of clear quartz. And it comes with a little information card. So this is a natural point of clear quartz. Very nice. And it says clear quartz is an amplifying stone that can add power to any spell or ritual. A powerful manifestation tool. Crystal points can be used to direct energy into the universe during rituals or crystal healing. So there is a reason why we sort of have that um, image of a wand at the end, a, a crystal at the end of a wand. I've got another, oh, I was going to say this was another crystal. It is crystal, but it's not just a crystal. This is a pendant. Oh, it's beautiful. So let's get that up the camera there so you can see. That is a piece of hematite that has been polished into a point and it's on a waxed cotton string with a lobster clasp. That's really very lovely. Um, so hematite power pendant. Carry the magical vibrations of hematite with you to empower. Hematite helps to promote confidence, self-esteem, mental clarity and strength during times of stress and anxiety. I shall be keeping that one close at hand. That is really very lovely and I've never seen a piece of hematite polished in that way. That's really lovely. Okay. Power amulets. Again, lovely attention to detail when it comes to packaging. But what do we have in here? Okay. okay. Just move that box for a second. So, Witch's Power Amulets, Ocean, Wheat, the Eye and the Apple, the Cactus and the Sun. Uh, not only can these amulets be carried with you as a magical charm, but they have other uses too. Use them in spellcraft, um, to set intentions, in divination, draw one from the pouch to find out what you need to focus on. to ruin you. Okay. Gosh, and this is like a little sort of somewhere between a faux suede and a velvet. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, I was expecting crystals um, or stones and I got little pewter, I think maybe. I've got pewter on the brain, but certainly yeah, metal. I'll look in the book to see if it says. So yeah, so we've got our our different symbols there. Um, similar, I guess, to sort of witch stones that we have had in the past, but in this case, little amulets that you can use to set an intention. And we've got our little booklet with all of the information in. That's very nice indeed. Okay, as you as you bounced out of my hand, the cactus. We'll read up on the cactus. Um, using spells for protection and banishing. Let go of that which does not serve. It could be that you are not protecting yourself or your energy lately, so set healthy boundaries and stick to them. Um, the fact that I'm currently not very well, and yeah, I'm still recording a video. <laughs> I feel like the universe is telling me maybe I should not work so hard when I'm not at my full energy. <laughs> so yes, thank you. <laughs> That's wonderful. <laughs> I will listen. Uh, okay, next item. Oh, this feels altar cloth, maybe? Let's have a look. Um, I'm trying to think. We've had a bag recently. This does, oh, let's just shifty my candles a little bit to give us a little bit more space. Yes, this is feeling like a really lovely altar cloth. I don't think I can get it 
to a stage where you can see all of it, but I will insert a photograph of it all laid out nicely. So we have got a sort of a universe symbol at the top here. Not quite earth, air, fire and water. No, we've got crystals, sky, sort of floral and then the sun. Really lovely. Very nice indeed. And um, the first time we've had, well, since I've been getting these, it's the first time we've had a cloth like this. We did have a very small mat previously, not one like this. And final item, oh, very lovely. This is a wooden shelf for your trinkets and your, your tiny beautiful things. And um, we've had some lovely little spell bottles in the past that would sit on here. This is really very lovely. So simple and yet you don't need everything to be all singing, all dancing. I really like that a lot. Oh, and finally, our scroll. You do get a scroll every month. Though last month it wasn't scrolled because the box was so full. Um, let's carefully, carefully peel that up. Okay, so this is Empowering Incantations. Spoken words to add power to your magic. Like an arrow come at speed, bring to me what I need. This is my command, what I say shall stand. I charge this spell with energy, what I desire shall come to me. My belief shall not waver, the tide shall turn in my favour. With this spell I decree as I will, so mote it be. So these are always printed on really lovely parchment paper. You can of course keep them as scrolls. You can stick them in a frame. They are roughly A4 in size. Um, I have recently been cutting out the bits that I like particularly and putting them into my own book of shadows. But you don't need to be particularly precious about these. Um, use them in a way that is useful to you. So that is our little haul from this month. That necklace is lovely. We've got our crystal there as well. I've got you caught up. Our necklace, the crystal, the amulets, pin badge, so many lovely things. Our spell kit and our herbs. I'll just have a quick flick through here. So again, this is the April kit and um, Deb and Ella are just thanking us and saying they are already working on May. So we've got the enchanted, enchanting altar cloth, um, designed and created exclusively for our subscribers, made with love from 100% cotton. The power amulets um, doesn't say exactly what they're made of. I will see if I can find out for you, but they are a metal of some kind. Um, the herb blend, hanging curiosity shelf. Hematite power pendant, powder kits, quartz point, pentacle enamel pin, incantations, parchment scroll, and the magic of art print. So, really, really lovely. Um, yeah, I just very little to say as ever. Um, these kits you never know exactly what you're going to get there are some monthly regulars like the pin badge and the scroll and the art card um, and a spell kit each month but you never know exactly what's going to be in them and that's that's one of the nice things is that it can bring sort of a spark of something new each month into your magical practice and i think that these are great items whether you are a seasoned practitioner or whether you are new to the craft and just finding your feet um, everything is ethically sourced, beautifully packaged, thoughtfully packaged as well. And um, yeah, I 
just think it it makes a difference when witchcraft pro products are produced or curated by witches <laughs> so um you will not get any tat here everything is useful and classy so i'm going to leave this here um do remember if you do subscribe that not only do you get your monthly box you get access to their store you also get monthly downloadables um, such as backgrounds for your computer your phone you get printable spells and other information for your book of shadows as well so there is lots of extra bits um, plus you are supporting a small business in the UK um, this box is available worldwide though um, prices and details are all in the description down below so thank you for joining me for this little unboxing today. If you like my content, please do hit the like button. It really helps the algorithm to know that people are watching my content. And if you want to leave me a comment about what was your favourite thing from this box, that always cheers me up. So thank you so, so much for joining me. I will see you in the next one. And until then, stay crafty.